Hey guys, what's up? How are you doing? Summer is just around the corner and that means vacation. If you're like me, you need to have your just certain things just have to be with you whenever you go on a vacation. And so here are the 10 things that I have to have every time I go on any extended vacation. Like, not like a two day vacation, but like seven days or longer, you know. Number one, I always bring with me a pillow. I always bring a pillow because I, you know, it's good for the car, it's good for the airplane, it's good for, you know, whatever you're doing. And also, I bring it with me personally because it, like, reminds me of my room, it smells like my room, and that just helps me fall asleep easier in a strange place. Number two, I bring with me what my family calls a Mexican blanket. I don't really know if that's the politically correct term for it, but, you know, that's what I'm calling it. So, sorry, correct me if I'm wrong. <laughs> uh, but it looks like this. And I will always bring this with me if I go camping. It is like the warmest blanket. It is guaranteed 100% to keep me warm. Item number three, this is a little weird. Um, I always pack with me a duffel bag. Not like a huge duffel bag, but like, you know, this size of a duffel bag. I will just, you know, I'll bring that, roll it up nice and tight and pack it in the suitcase because typically if I'm going somewhere for a week or longer, I'm gonna come back with more stuff than I arrived with. So, packing the duffel bag, you know, instead of being like, oh, where am I gonna fit all this new stuff I bought because I'm an idiot and didn't think through the head, um, well, put it in the duffel bag. And it all works out. Number four, I always try and bring books with me. Like, you know, these guys right here. Woo! I bring a book because they don't require a power outlet or anything and they still provide me with hours of joy. Number five, I always bring with me some DVDs. Uh, this way I can watch DVD if I feel like it, it's a good way to knock out, you know, an hour or two hours depending on the DVD. I always bring, you know, multiple types. I bring like a kid's movie, um, you know, if I'm watching it with like a younger person. Or I'll bring more adult ones like this, which is a really good movie, kind of Monte Cristo. Recommend it. Item number six. I always bring with me my iPad, but before I go on my trip, I make sure I download some games that don't require the internet, just in case I don't have any internet. And if I'm on the car or plane, I can, you know, use it in airplane mode or whatever. You know, don't have Wi-Fi. It's not a 3G iPad, unfortunately. Number seven. This one's a little weird. I always bring with me some tea. I bring a black tea and an herbal tea. Black tea for the morning. This one's Earl Grey, my favorite. Black tea of all time. And then refreshed tea. Peppermint tea. I just love peppermint tea. It's soothing and relaxing, and I always feel like it helps me do things or something. I don't know. It just makes me feel better. Number eight. Sometimes um, I like to play my video games, like, I love my video games, I always want to play video games, let's be real, so, but I don't always have a console with me because they're bigger, and sometimes I'll take it, but like, at my dad's house I know we've got a Wii there, and so I won't bring mine, you know, I'll just use his, maybe I'll bring a video game or two, and sometimes like, I'll be playing it and then, you know, gotta get kicked off because everybody wants to watch, you know, the game or whatever, and so I always bring with me a little Game Boy, Pokemon in it. Uh, this is Pokemon Red, you know, one of my all-time favorites. And number nine, bring my computer, you know? I don't really need internet, I need a power outlet, but I don't need internet. I have games on it, like Diablo, Starcraft, and I can watch those DVDs I brought with me. So, you know, helpful. Number ten, I bring you guys. I never know if I'm going to want to share something with you guys that's like, meaningful or anything. So those are the 10 items I have to have when I go on vacation. In the comments down below, let me know what you guys have to have on your vacations, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye! But, so like, the first page is actually page 289 and it counts down from there, and it's chapter 47 and counts down from there. The chapters are really short, which I really like because they First time I tried to record it, ran out of space. Second time I tried to record it, you know, ran out of video. You know, whatever. Sometimes, my videos, my camera only records for 10 minutes at a time, which is kind of stupid, but whatever, problems.